Josh Caster, and today, well today is my No Time to Die, Dodd Spoiler Review. And don't worry, I won't be talking like this the entire video, okay? So, uh, I'm just, I just want to do that because, well, it's James Bond, it's No Time to Die, it's a James Bond movie. And it's actually the last uh, James Bond movie for Daniel Craig, obviously. Now there's going to be someone else who's going to play it next. I'm hoping maybe Daniel, no, not Daniel, um, Henry Cavill. Uh, Henry Cavill, I think it would be an interesting choice to play him next. But, like I said, this is a farewell to Daniel Craig. And it is, I would say, a farewell to Daniel Craig. But I wouldn't say it's like the ending of this movie. I wouldn't say it's the way I would want a farewell for Daniel Craig as James Bond. But, I'm like I said, I'm not going into too, any details about it because this is a non-spoiler review. So, uh, it's a, you know, it's a James Bond movie. I mean, it pretty much does everything you expect from a James Bond movie. Uh, with, I think there are some things, like, that they took out that are, I, I think some, some stuff that are kind of iconic, I guess, for, uh, James Bond movies goes, but... I'm not, not going to say what those are, obviously, but it, it's, you know, a James Bond movie, so, uh, and I think the writing was definitely, it's, like, not, well, before I go into writing, the film itself, uh, it's beautifully filmed, I mean, you get a bunch of scenery in different places around the world, and they just shot that beautifully, as, uh, as they always do, and I think the places they... Uh, film should definitely be happy because they really made those places look like beautiful uh, so if you're probably watching this film you pro if you figure out where those places are from obviously I think they mentioned the credits where these places are from or they did anyway you know you get a sense of like oh that place is beautiful I would want to go there so they should be happy about that but yeah the footage is the the, the entire film was just beautifully filmed I have to admit uh, that, that was definitely one of the best parts. The story, uh, it had, you know, I really do, I uh, did enjoy the story. Like I said, I'm not, like, I, even the ending, like, I think, um, I, I enjoy, I like the ending, and, but I would have still want a different ending anyway, despite that fact, okay? Um, but... Nonetheless, it was definitely, uh, and I think the writing was really good. As always, like the characters are very interesting, and I really enjoy enjoy the characters. I mean, there's not really much else to uh, to say that, but I think if you are a huge James Bond film, you're going to leave the theater satisfied. Uh, I, for if the, you know, I think it's really a very interesting uh, that aspect. You know, it you know it had it was beautifully filmed. The writing was good. And I think you still enjoyed the characters, and you all have the and the action sequence, man. The action sequences are phenomenal. Okay, as always for James Bond. I mean, who would want to watch a James Bond film and not expect action, right? There, there, the, the action is well done, and uh, that as well. I you know for there's nothing really much else to say. Other than that, because obviously it's a James Bond movie, there's going to be action, and they, you know, they, as always, that's good. Uh, and I, I like action, right? Um, that, you know, that's the problem with the Black Widow film. Like, that just, the action is just not what you expect for a Black Widow film. And that's one of my problems with the Black Widow film. So, uh, definitely, definitely, I do recommend this uh, movie. Uh, if you like James Bond, I recommend you watch this movie. If you... Like Daniel Craig as James Bond, well, or you know, you mean like if you didn't like the other James Bond movies, but you like Daniel Craig as James Bond because you've seen the other one, definitely check those. Uh, definitely watch this movie because he he as always he did he did a phenomenal job as James Bond, and uh, yeah, so pretty much if you like action, I definitely recommend. And you haven't seen any James Bond movies, I definitely recommend watching some James Bond movies. So I've seen them all actually. Uh, believe it or not, so a uh, pretty interesting thing there as well. Uh, can't wait to see the next James Bond movie and see where that goes. Uh, so yeah, all right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. If you are new, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know if I ever next upload my YouTube channel website link. 
My Twitter, my Snapchat, and Instagram are all in the description as always. And thank you. Goodbye.